Hello guys, what's up? This is Kehis for After Effects Tutorial Channel and now working with 3D Particle Globe. Okay, creating by trap code form. How to create this? Let's start. Okay, create a new composition, name it main com and press enter and uh, double click on project import 3d uh, sorry import world map for 3d uh, sphere 3d globe and now go to window workspace change the workspace after effect to effects and type here linear color key drop and clear the white background for removing the age white background matte choker double click okay great right click on image and pre-compose move all effects or masks into composition and change the name map press enter and double click drop another effect mm, fill and select the color of fill like this go back to main comp and right click create a new solid name it form press enter and go to effects trap code form then go to base form and select sphere layer and change the sphere layers one and change the size and create a new camera 24 millimeter and press ok select again the form and turn off the map composition and go to layer maps color and alpha select the map and RGBA like this okay now go to particle in X particle in Y and close the layer map go to particles change the size 1 1.5 and there is feather change the feather into 0 and now select form layer press ctrl D for duplicate and down the X particles and change the size press control three line for the sphere and go back to layer maps select color and alpha layer to none and close again and change the colors bright yellow and change the size one one and now change the layer maps RGBA to RGB and close again select the form press ctrl D again and go to layer maps none RGB and then change to zero three layers and change the size like this and 0 0.5 and change the color to yellow okay that's good press control
and select another layer change to 0 0.5 0 0.5 and change the rate of y particles okay now change the position like this and change another position like this okay select again the word map form layer and press ctrl D duplicate and down the particles rate and now 0 0.5 and go back to disperse and change the disperse rate like this and there is random size random size you can change again equal 150 150 particles and there is about size 1.5 like this 1.5 change to 1 yeah that's great and now animate the disperse rate from start 5 seconds 3 seconds change like this okay right click create a new adjustment layer and drop glow double click yeah that's good and select the camera go to layer camera setting change into 20 and track Z zoom in the camera and now go back to word map layer and change the rate 200 200 and right click create a new mm, null object for animating the camera parent web to camera move your null object select the move to Now select the camera layer parent web to null object. Uh, sorry, select null object. Move now. Yeah, that's great. And now turn on the 3D switch and uh, press R for rotation and press Alt click on Y rotation. And now you can type time star. Hundred play now. This is the random rotation. If you want to make rotation stopwatch, go to three seconds and change to one. This is about three hundred. 60 degree and select all layers ctrl a and turn on the motion blur and right click create a new solid for um, light background press enter and go back to effects and uh, create motion graphic no stylize no light factory down of all layers and select no light factory move here okay right click create new solid stars press enter and uh, drop form form 
double click this is another form and um, change the particle in Z to 1 and uh, go to disperse disperse this and go to particles random size where is random size this is about random size and this is about random opacity and change 3.5 like this and now press ok change the size more and down off the layers and turn on motion blur like this yeah that's great and select adjustment layer need more glow effect double click this is about glow effect uh, need the light background top of adjustment layer and press F4 for mode change to add like this and select the adjustment layer change setting of second glow effect yeah this so pretty nice okay go to edit purge your all memory and disk cache for rendering okay I think there is a little change on some lines change again to zero and this is really good and what about this change this one to zero zero what about this zero yeah now that's good okay now you can render from start render now okay this was about uh, 3d particle loop or uh, sphere thank you for watching don't forget like and subscribe the channel good luck all of you